Okay, I'm back. Number two. Number two. So listen to this here. Praise God. So listen to this here. This is where the problem comes in at. See, when you try to figure out something that you don't understand, that's where the problem comes in at. See, when you're trying to mind someone else's business, that's where it comes in at. And you're confused by what you don't understand when it's nothing that concerns you. So you relate it to something that is bad because how is it? This rabbits just keep jumping out of the hats. So let's be clear about a few things and understand something. When you're trying to understand someone else, first go home and do yourself. See, evaluate your own life. See, you have to do your own assessment, man, of your own, what's going on with you. <clears throat> your expenses, your attitude, your appetite, the way you think, the way you think. Not it has nothing to do with anybody else in the room. You have to do that to yourself, man. See, you can't relate other people to who you are because they're not you. See, if you smoke cigarettes, that's probably $10 a day. If you smoke a pack a day. That's $10 a day, man. So if you smoke for seven days a week, that's 70 days. So every two weeks, that's 140 a month. What is that? 280 something. I'm not good now, but 280 a month just for smoking cigarettes if it's $10 a day. Do your expenses. Do your counts. Say, why you say that? Because I'm telling you with me, my lifestyle. <clears throat> Listen, man, I'm going to tell you something. Anything that you do in your life, you can't sit and peep out your window, follow other people, and then try to figure out how they got a new hat. You understand? You cannot do that, man. You eat lobster, I eat sardines. See, you go to the fancy stores and shop, I go to the thrift store. See, you need chicken, you need this there, you go in there and you probably do this. You think I'm going in there, I'm stealing it. No, no, man. See, you got to have humility and you got to be humble, man, before you understand anybody else. Some people do simple things like, help me. When you won't. Hey, I got something for my people in a minute. Let me finish her. Let me finish him first, okay? Let me get these people first. These haughty, you know, uh, condescending type people. You cannot virtually harass other people's lives, man, because of what you think in your own head while you're sitting and doing things. You drink alcohol. I don't know how often, but at least cost $10 a bottle now. You understand? I don't. You understand? Some of y'all use drugs. Some of y'all got gambling habits. Some of you play lottery every day. I play once a month or once every three, four months, and I win. You understand? I don't go to casinos. I don't do all that. See, I don't have brand new Range Rovers, trucks, and, and, and all this. No. You understand? I don't go on cruises and yachts. Never been on one in my life. I know some of you look at small for me being honest about that. Right, right. But it's the truth. See, I ain't been to Jamaica and all that with, with, the, with the groups of people and spending money. Then you come back and you be mad at everybody else because they ain't paid your money back. I don't go through that. You understand? Some of you, what you do, man, you do. You have all these expenses and you want somebody else to pay for it. I mean, the bologna sandwich, you want me to help you give you some gas for a Range Rover. Yeah, for a brand new one, 2022. And I'm sitting here walking. I'm on the bus. Your mama going to nursing home, cleaning up crap and making up beds. And you land here and you live in up above and beyond your means and you want her to pay for your, for your truck or pay for your cruise. Pay for you to look the way you look. You's a fraud and you phony. And anybody who like you is, same thing. You people walk around hazing and what you do, try to bully other people, man, for the little bitty things to help you make you look the way you want to look. Be careful about the people who you bully, by the way. Be careful, man, about the people who you don't know, man. What you call suicide, man, to some people is suicide to them is when you're trying to bully them, they kill everybody because they know they're going to die anyway. You see what I'm saying? That's suicide. You got to understand, man, you can't do that to everybody, man. Everybody's not going to take that, man. Like I told you, some of y'all walk out here, man, you thinking and you're trying to understand somebody else's life according to who you are, man. Some of y'all out here tricking off, man. You spending money with these to be with these women thinking that you that they care about you because you spending you never really know stop giving them and you'll find out see you being treated a certain way kind of way because of what the expenses are that the, what you're doing buying coats and paying car notes and paying mortgages and buying this and taking care of all the kids and all the grandkids and then judge somebody else and say you supposed to do this too this is the way it go how you gonna tell somebody else their lifestyle the way they supposed to do it you don't you ain't even happy doing what you're doing yourself you saying it's the right way because you're paying for what you want. So you're trying to say it's the right way to do because it it's taking a lot out your pocket. So you figure somebody else should take it out of their pocket. Come on, man. Listen, man. 
Stop judging other people according to who you are. You don't know other people. Look, it's all kind of characters and personalities. And it's one that's very rare and unique. It's like a unicorn. It's not like any. And you come from discipline, man. I'm coming right back. I'm going to tell you something else.